Everybody Norm over here, and I've got everybody's favorite guitar player sitting right next to me. I mean, everybody in the store, Joe Bonamassa, he, he says, and Joe's good buddies with Josh, uh, he says, there's one guitar player that terrifies me, and that is Josh Smith. Yeah, and I know a lot of people don't want to get <laughs> up on stage with you because they don't want you to blow them away. Man. And he can play the crap out of the blues and R&B stuff. He was with Raphael Sadiq and all kinds of people. Our buddy Kirk Fletcher does a lot of stuff with him. Yeah, that's my buddy. My Schofield, you do a bunch of stuff with him. Uh, you know, and you just came back off the road from where? I just got back from Japan and Australia. All right. Yeah, it was a good tour. And uh, I said I hit, hit a lot of new countries this year. I hit South America for the first time, at least doing my own thing. I've been there as a side man, but cool. there in Australia was my first time doing my own thing there. And it was really nice to have people show up. Well, his career is building. And trying, so if you guys don't know who hard, Josh Smith hard. is, you better pay attention because this guy's badass. Thanks. So, and um, tell me, you, you're producing other acts too they I'm come in here a lot yeah these days uh, i have my own studio flat five studios um and this year i've produced five records other than my own so that was nice and i'm doing a lot of that it's tough sometimes fizzle, filling out the schedule around the touring but this year i produced arthur menezes album who you know he's great and yeah. my friend seth rosenblum from boston whose album comes out next month uh, my friend Jamie Aaron's record, a great guitar player, and then Joe and I actually produced together uh, Reese Wine and solo album, which will be out here That's in the spring, great. and uh, I'm excited about that. He produced Reese Wine's record. Reese is me, Joe, and Paul Sarah. Yeah, and yeah that, that record is special. keyboard player, yeah. boy, I'll tell you. Yeah. That so guy I've can play. Been working on that, and uh, okay. next weekend I'm recording a live record at the Big Potato over two nights, a, a Blu-ray and a record, uh, December 29th and 30th. So if you're in LA. Please come out because you know how you want to pack when you do a live record so it's loud. You it's get easy. audience it's, noise. Well, you know? It's easy to, to uh, pack the baked potato. That place is tiny, but it's a great intimate place to yep. Yep. see a band and all that. Yeah. So, um, and you're going to be on the Joe Bonamassa Blues Cruise? It'll be the fifth one, yeah. I've been on every one so far. Uh, Kirk and I normally play together all the time. This year we're actually doing both. We're each getting our own sets and we're playing together, so that's nice. We'll have cool. separate bands, it'll be cool. We have a girl who works here now from time to time, Sarah Rogo, who happens to be great. And uh, I know she's going to be on the cruise. Oh, and nice. uh, there's a, It's going to be, it's always a great schedule. There's always great people playing. Yeah, it's a great time. And uh, so I'm going to shut up and let you play this D'Angelico. Now, Josh can play the bebop stuff like I crazy. I try. <laughs> ah, shut up. And then he can massacre on a Strat or a Telly or a Les Paul. Josh Smith on a D'Angelico. Let's play some, some bebop blues on a D'Angelico because that's what you do. favorite all the guys are scared to death uh, of Josh Smith. No, no, no. I don't no, know no, if it's no. that wrestling thing that you do or what it is, it is but they're a, afraid to get up on these, the, yeah. afraid to get up on stage with Josh Smith and I don't blame him because without even trying, he's so natural it just uh, kills it. Uh, so um, he's a sore favorite here and uh, everybody I know that knows Josh is in awe of him. I'm not trying to kiss up to him. He's my buddy, <laughs> but you know, I'm just saying the truth, guys. This guy Thank is you, badass. Norm. Thank you, Norm. So, uh, you check it out at the Baked Potato. 29th and 30th. All right. All right. Thank you.